my favorite part about working here, I would have to say, is the community that it builds and all the relationships that I've built, just teaching people, teaching kids, and uh, teaching adults all these different easy and hard obstacles. <laughs> David Franklin has been working at Ninja Obstacle Academy for a year and a half, and in that time, has become sort of a local celebrity. <laughs> I was at a water park and I'm at the top of a slide, and I hear three different kids jumping at the bottom of the slide saying, Coach David, Coach David, and they're freaking out looking at the sky, and then I come down and I hit the ground in the water, and they were like, that was so cool. And that relationship Coach David has built with children has helped popularize the kids' camps, encouraging these young ninjas to be active. Exercise, I feel like, in our society, or at least in our age group, has been, hey, you did something wrong, do 25 push-ups. Here, it's, you did something right, let's go do a pull-up together. Being able to sit at the dinner table and think like, oh yeah, I could jump over this and I could swing from that, like all the time. It's just a, like a, a feeling of freedom. I think it's just really good for you. And of the activities offered to the kids, there is one that seems to be the most magnetic. Probably the warped wall. The warped wall. I like the wall. I like climbing the wall. An obstacle that, at its core, symbolizes the perseverance these kids learn from this experience. I want them to know that no matter how you try, you don't have to be good at it. You can be good at something else. I just wanted to be on the news. Well, Caitlin, you got your wish. In Huntsville, Jonah Carp, Fox 54 Sports.